everybody this is Bobby with Bobby Stamps and I'm going to show you how to make this cute card today. This is going to be one of my free card packets for May. So how that works is if you spend um, $25 in my online store you would receive one of the free card packets. If you spend $35 you'll receive two and if you spend $50 you receive all three. So this is just one of the cards um, that would qualify for that. I'll have other videos with card two and card three coming up. So you can visit my blog. It's bobbystamps.blogspot.com and I'll have all the details on there. Um, so we'll just go ahead and get started in making this card. We're going to use the base is old olive. Let me grab my cart and move it a little bit closer so I can reach my stuff. So I'm just going to put a nice crease in that. And then the second layer is Daffodil Delight, and this piece is cut at four by five and a quarter. And then I'm going to use a piece of DSP paper that is cut at three by five and a quarter. And then I use the layering circles to cut out my little circle to stamp on. So we'll just go ahead and do that really quick and grab our mat. We're going to use um, Flirty Flamingo and Chocolate Chip. The stamp set I'm using is Sprinkle of Life, and it comes with the coordinating punch. And then this is the layering circles I was just telling you that I'm going to be using. And then I'm also using the Flirty Flamingo Ruched Ribbon. So we will just go ahead and open up. I'm going to do the chocolate chip first. And that's what we're going to stamp our tree in. And I'm going to center it, but I am going to put it just a smidge over to the left just to make sure that I have room for my sentiments. Okay, then I am going to grab, I thought I had a piece out, but evidently I didn't. So let me grab a piece of scrap paper here really quick. Let me cut that off. Okay, so then we'll open up Flirty Flamingo. And we're just going to use the stamp that's got the, um, like, flowers for the treetop. So we're just going to stamp that. I think I'm going to stamp it this way. Just push down with it. And then we will use the punch to punch that out. And this is a really versatile stamp set because you can use the punch to cut out all these um, designs here, the flower and the leaves or the cloud. It's just when you have the tree, you have the bird, the apple, rain, and then like a little petal of a flower. It's a super cute stamp set. I'm going to go ahead and bring in our little circle again. And then the sentiment is the one that says, thanks a bunch. We're going to just stamp that or ink that up in Flirty Flamingo and just stamp it right there to the side. That's all the stamping we have to do, guys. This card is super quick to put together. So let's grab our snail and we'll just put some snail on the back like so. And then we're going to center this on our base. Then we're going to take the DSP and we're going to cut enough ribbon like that. Grab some tape and then we're just going to fold this side over to the back adhere it with the tape. Make sure we don't have it twisted and it's pretty straight on this side. Put some more tape there. And then I like to cut another piece and I usually just guess at this. And I'm going to go ahead and make the little ends pointed and then I just put it through whichever corner I want it to be on. And you can tie it in a double knot, but I think a single knot is going to be fine. And then we'll just re 
cut it there at the end so it's not so long. And you will receive um, the ribbon for me because this is no longer going to be available in the new catalog and I have a ton of it. So happy to give it to my customers. Okay. Then what we're going to do is just center this piece right there like that. And then we'll grab some dimensionals and I used two, just kind of put two on each end. Okay. And then we're just going to put that where we want it to be on our tree. Like that. Flip that over. And I'm going to put about three dimensionals here on the back of that. I'm thinking about using this for my April thank you cards. I'm a little bit behind on sending those out to my customers that placed an order in my online store. So I think this is going to be a super quick one and easy to put together. And that's probably what I'm going to use this card for as well. So visit my blog for all the details and you can find out how you can earn this free card packet. It's bobbystamps.blogspot.com. Thanks guys.